Hi, welcome back to Kianda the Smart Home. This video is dedicated to one of the features of EVLink app, which is EVLink Cast. It allows you to create multiple dashboards based on your needs and then gives you quick access to control your EVLink devices and scenes via web browser by using wall mount touch panels, for instance. In this video, I show you how to use this Cast feature from creating dashboards to controlling your devices by touch panel. First of all, you have to update your EVLink account to advance by navigating to profile, tapping update now in advanced plan section. Then you can use web EVLink and log into your account on multiple tablets at the same time. Before continuing, subscribe and press the bell button to receive every new video. Evening Cast is an add-on for Evening Web. That means, as I mentioned, you have to be in advanced plan. If not, by navigating to this web page, you can also upgrade your account to advanced. VIP.evening.cc. My account is already upgraded to advanced. So I can log in to my account using web.evening.cc. In this web page, I enter my account credential, then login. This is the Evelink web as you see on dashboard. We have all paired devices to my account. On the left bar, we have cast. I select it. Tap plus to create your first dashboard first of all set a name for your dashboard then you see we have different tabs select devices select scenes charts and settings I click settings you can select your background color I select this one you can lock your dashboard by setting an access pin code to avoid unwanted dashboard switching. Also, you can display calendar and weather. Search for a city, for example, Bear. Let's select devices for this dashboard. I mean, actually, tap select devices, choose devices. You can drag and drop the icons in the preview area on the right to sort them. You see? I also want to add scenes in this dashboard. So tap select scenes. I have one scene I selected. It is added. Then I click save. The first dashboard, which its name is Actuators, is Create. Tap plus to create another dashboard. Set a name for it. In this dashboard, I want to have all my sensors. So I select my sensors. By navigating to Charts, as you see, we can have Charts. By navigating to settings, you can select background color. Also, you can set pin code and choose to display calendar and weather. At the end, click save. Currently, you can add up to five dashboards. After creating dashboards, you can edit them easily by navigating to cast on web.evlink.cc webpage. Click edit of each dashboard you want to edit. And then you can sort your dashboard and edit it. Adding devices, removing devices, and etc. Do not forget to tap save after editing. Let's create another dashboard, set it cams, Meaning cameras, isolate cam. 
this is my son of camera, IP camera. Save. Using web.evilink.cc, I have created dashboard in cast section. By navigating to cast.evilink.cc, and logging into your account by selecting dashboards. You can control your devices and scenes. I click actuators as it needs pin code. I enter its pin code. We have devices, the chart, and you can control them. Also, as you see, at the top of the screen, we have calendar and weather. Switching needs pin code. This time I open sensors dashboard. You see, we have selected devices. Now I choose CAMS dashboard. This is my camera. By the way, by using Web Evening, you can do more than just customizing CAST. For example, by navigating to my home section, selecting rooms, you can see your devices. Change settings of them, as you see, for example, POW, you can change its name, change its location. Also, if a new version is available, you can update it. In addition, by navigating to device management, we have to check for upgrades. As you see, there is a new version for my RF gateway. I select it, click upgrade to upgrade it to the latest version. Also, using Web Evilink, creating scenes is more easier than using the app. I navigate to scenes, click add, set a name for your scene, for example, the trigger, tap to run, then you see how fast you can create scenes. Easily by clicking. I have created a new scene and now I can add it to one of the dashboards. I navigate to cast, choose the dashboard. I want to add the created scene to it. Click edit, navigate to select scenes, choose the scene, all lights on, save. It's time to show you how to use touch panel to control your Evelink devices using the cast feature. These are my Sonoff devices paired with my Evilink account. I have Sonoff Zigbee Bridge, Sonoff Temperature and Humidity Sensor, Zigbee Motion Sensor, Zigbee Involve Switch, Zigbee Door Window Sensor, and Zigbee Scene Button. I also have RF Bridge, NS Panel, NS Panel Pro, Dual Relay, and POW. This is AccuWorks Android Touch Panel. I navigate to application, open browser. Navigate to cast.evilink.cc. After entering 
credentials of my account I tap login we have created dashboards by tapping on each of them it opens and you can control your devices this is an panel this is dual relay this is POW Zigbee involved switch run all lights on run all off as you see at the top of the screen we have calendar and weather switching needs pin code let's open sensors dashboard this is door window sensor this door window sensor is paired with Sonoff NS Panel Pro that's it thank you for watching if you have any question do not hesitate to leave comments also Please subscribe my channel if you haven't done yet as it motivates me to upload more videos. I'll see you in the next video.